deal with God's creation, with the people around us, how we deal with the food. Because the Prophet, peace be upon him, was a mercy. Not just to the Muslims, not just to the Indonesians, not just to the people of LA, not just to the people of Cape Town, but to every single thing. One thing I learned is we have to envelop and develop and express mercy with one another. That's one big lesson that I learned. Uh, and so that's the public. But we also focus on the private. It's our connection with the source of all of this. That's God Almighty. That's Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Fasting, we can fast and no one would know if we're fasting or not. Unless we tell them. Unless we tell them. But when we're praying, people are seeing. It's very public. It's, it's not hidden in the public eye. When we're fasting, when we're doing these things out of sincerity, only God truly knows what's inside our hearts. That's the challenge for us when we go from Ramadan outside of Ramadan. What is the change for us? Is there a change from before Ramadan, during Ramadan, after Ramadan? Am I still the same person? Because the Prophet, peace be upon him, he says, and I'll end it with here, there are many a people that out of Ramadan, the only thing that they get is just hunger and thirst. For me, that's a big reflection. Am I just hungry? Am I just thirsty? We ask these questions in a way to get closer to the divine. To ask these real questions, why am I here? Where did I come from? And so on and so forth. So I invite everyone, inshallah, to be reminded of these fundamental questions of why I'm doing this. To really check our intentions and bring these intentions, these sincere intentions, these sincere intentions, inshallah, from Ramadan into outside Ramadan. Because we all have our struggles. No one's perfect. But unfortunately, in the community, there's lots of toxic expectations that happens. So we try to build up one another. We try to encourage each other. We try to be supportive of each other. That's the Muslim thing. That's the Muslim. That's how the believers are. We welcome to the Sufru. In the name of the Lord.